Hi y'all and welcome to day two of our Breckenridge trip. Today we just got off the gondolas. This morning we got a quick workout in and we're gonna be heading over to Uller Fest, downtown Breckenridge on Main Street. So join us if you'd like to see the 59th annual Uller Fest. So we're on our way to check-in. Check-in time is between 12.30 and 2.30 p.m. and Uller Fest is running from December 8th to December 11th. So we just checked in for Uller Fest. They'll give you a wristband and then this sticker needs to be visible on the outside of your clothing. They also give you a little shot glass with your shot and the Velcro on the bottom that you can stick to the shot ski. We're gonna be in the unofficial world record longest shot ski event. Okay, so lining up for the shot ski event is between 3.30 and 4 o'clock that you need to be out there. Right now it's about 2.45, so we're just gonna walk around and explore downtown. There's tons of cool places to walk around on Main Street. It looks like a Christmas village right now. It is absolutely beautiful. So we're just kind of exploring some shops and probably gonna get a coffee before we line up for the Shotsky event. Okay, so we're at the Crown Coffee Bar on Main Street in Breck. I got the Irish coffee. It has Irish whiskey, Irish cream, whipped cream on top. Kale got the Tootsie Roll with hot chocolate. And chocolate whiskey. Nice. Delicious, boozy coffee. So once it was time to line up for the event, we all attached our shot glasses to the skis and the whiskey was from the Breckenridge Distillery. At Uller Fest, locals and visitors from all ages come to praise Uller, who's the Norse god of snow, in hopes of a snow-filled ski season. People really go out with the Viking hats and all of the costumes. It was so cool to see. There's even an Uller king and queen that are nominated each year and crowned at the event. It 
then came time for everyone to start lifting up the skis. This was actually pretty impressive. It went a lot smoother than I thought. We started getting our shots ready and then it started on one end and just kind of waved its way through. And the official numbers were 1,350 participants and 468 skis. We then made our way back over to the crown to watch the parade. First place was the Clark and Cousin Eddie show, a Christmas vacation tribute. The second place float was Ferris Uller's Day Off. And the third place was Summit County River Rats and Pirates. I hope you enjoyed this day two vlog and thank you for watching.